Today is International Women's Day, a day when the world comes together to celebrate, commemorate and to value women and women's contribution to humanity, to stand together as women and with women. This year's celebration is unlike any other. Our world is changing. Our lives have been disrupted in unprecedented ways. And as with most disasters, the pandemic has put women on the front lines. As leaders of responses, as frontline workers in hospitals, as caregivers, homeschoolers and wage earners, as survivors of abuse in their own homes. Women have both led the response to COVID-19 across the world and have experienced the greatest impact of the crisis. As the pandemic played out with devastating effect, a new leadership has emerged. Women leaders across the world redefined strong and effective leadership and demonstrated how the values of consultative and caring leadership deliver better outcomes for entire nations. COVID-19 gave leadership a woman's face. Perhaps the unimaginable crisis is what we needed to reimagine our world, to redefine a new normal that included all of humanity in all our diversity and power. Now is the time to redefine our new normal, embracing the gender equality revolution we've been waiting for. COVID-19 has put a spotlight on the failures of our social contract with new clarity and across the world, people are refusing to look away. Now is the time to reset, to reshape, to rebuild, to recover better, stronger and more equal, to demand equal rights for all. For women, for men, for the next generation, for peace and for Afghanistan.